Independent Contractors United is a group of carriers who used to previously be employed, or I'm sorry, who used to uh, previously be contracted with the Daily Hampshire Gazette and Greenfield Recorder who um, have either lost their jobs completely right. or have been forced to work for this new distribution company that the, the Gazette has hired in our place. I see. And so, um, what's your issue here? Why are you protesting? Um, because one, oh, there's a lot of reasons. The in in general, the decisions made by the executives and um, the publishers at the Gazette to outsource our management of um, all of the independent contractors, it was irresponsible on so many levels. Irresponsible to our local economy. Irresponsible to the youth in our community. Irres irresponsible to the thousands and thousands of customers who receive the newspaper on a daily basis. And irresponsible to the independent contractors who have been loyal to them for years and years. I see. And so, your um, one of your colleagues told me that she's making less money for more work and the same amount of gas? Absolutely correct. Um, actually, I don't know about in her case, but in mine, I'm going an extra 14 miles every night on my route to do, uh, I have an, an estimate of about 200 papers more every single night to deliver in the same amount of time for half the amount of money that I was getting before. Can I ask you how much money you were making delivering papers before? Um, complete My complete between um, what I was actually being paid in my check from the Daily Hampshire Gazette and what I was collecting when um, an another side effect to this is that customers can no longer pay their carriers directly. They have to pay the Gazette now. So before I was receiving 60 to $80 a week in, in the stuff I would collect directly from my carriers and about 160, which is a range of 130 to 190, but an average of 160 a week from them. Plus. Plus this. Yeah, right. So around $250 a week is what I was getting And before. so how many hours was that about? Um, that was a about two hours a night, six nights a week, so about 12 hours. So now I'm working from three in the morning till seven in the morning. That's four hours a night, double the time. Yeah. I'm doing a total of 320 papers a night now mm -hmm. versus before I was only doing a, um, 130, mm -hmm. 135. Yeah. And now I'm receiving $250 a week. Same amount of money. Twice the amount of work, twice the amount of time, additional gas. Now they're taking part of our tips. They're charging us for the bags that we deliver our paper. And, and the money that is being collected for the papers isn't even staying in our local economy anymore. It's being outsourced to some company from Maryland. It's ridiculous. Can I ask you your name? Yeah, Ginger Plantier. P-L-A-N-T-I-E-R. Where do you live? I live in West Hatfield, Massachusetts. Thank you. Thank you.